Hey everyone, long time no talk. This is Ben. Um, it's been about four months since I've shot a video, and uh, there's a good reason for that. Uh, one, my camera was broken uh, in a drunken rage on uh, New Year's Eve. Uh, it wasn't really a drunken rage, someone dropped it taking pictures, but kind of took me a while to get a new camera. Also, just been some family stuff going on and some personal stuff, and just didn't really have anything to talk about, so. Um, what brings me to today is, well, today is my birthday, so 37, old. Don't feel old, but 37 just sounds old. But uh, I've got some stuff to show, um, some things I've gotten since the last time I did a video, which was back in December. Um, what you're looking at now is the uh, new NECA um, Scream or Ghostface uh, figure. Um, it's the one that has kind of the zombie kind of face there. It's all torn up and everything. It's a cool looking figure. And I got the other one up here too. I just kept him in the box. That one right there. Because I already have the McFarlane one that's open, so I thought I'd keep him in there. Um, the other thing that's cool is I have my tickets to go see Scream 4 at the midnight showing tonight. Really excited about that. I've heard good things about the film, so what I will do is I will post my review of the film this weekend. Um, maybe even tomorrow after I see it, since um, I'll be seeing it tonight. I'm uh, really looking forward to it. I actually just watched all three of the other films, uh, just to get a marathon going. Psyched about it. Excited. Um, some other stuff I wanted to show off was... The little figures I got in here. So by Funko. They did a bunch of these little guys here. So they did a Jason... Uh, Michael Myers, Beetlejuice, and a Gremlin, and I also have Freddy right there. So these are some new things I've gotten. Um, they also did plush ones, so I got the Jason one right there. And I'll pick him up just so you can see him a little bit better. See him right there. Just a little doll. They're kind of cool. I like them. Um, got the Freddy one. He's kind of in the corner there. You can't see him. Right there's Freddy right there in the back. And then there's also a Michael Myers one, which I have over here. He's hiding back there, if you can see him. And the last thing I want to show is what I got for my birthday. This over real quick. Um, I'm a huge fan of the Expendables movie, and... The company that did the jewelry that Stallone wore in the movie, they're called Good Art in Hollywood. And this is the lucky ring that Stallone wore in the film. Um, it's a silver, all silver version. His was kind of gold toned, um, had a little bit more going on. Um, I just like a silver anyway, but uh, I contacted them and they made this for me. And this was my birthday gift because it was kind of pricey. The other thing I got, and this is something I got a few months ago, is the uh, three skull bracelet that he wore as well. So they do some great work. Their stuff is a little pricey. But if you're really interested in getting some really sturdy, well-made jewelry um, that you might have to spend a little more on, I completely recommend Good Art Hollywood. Um, what I'll do is I'll put a link in the description so people can check it out. Um, the lucky ring that I got, I actually had to contact them about. They don't have it listed on their website, but the bracelet is listed on there. So you can see it there. And just wanted to say hey to everybody. Um, and expect more videos from me coming up. Uh, again, sorry it's taken me so long to do this again, but it's been a rough year. Hopefully things are going to get better these next couple months. and. Uh, Look forward to people's feedback and hope everyone has a good day and take care.